Welcome back to Genius Yield. This is Riley with Invest Global, and today we're going to be going over ISPOs on Cardano and how you can actually utilize this mechanism with Genius Yield, the automated yield optimizer for the Cardano ecosystem built natively. So for those people who aren't really familiar with Cardano, which is all what Genius Yield is about, is really leveraging the beautiful benefits that Cardano has kind of built in um, as far as incentive structures, reward mechanisms, using actual stake pools to incentivize users to actually delegate and then earn some passive income off that and also have an incentive for the people that actually run these stake pools. So ISPOs are much different than other ways to raise capital in the crypto market that actually have a ton of risk associated with them because people are essentially locking up their funds, they're investing their funds. And typically what happens with a lot of IDOs out there, I would say we saw this in 2017 with ICOs, why this model is flawed and why Cardano came in with ISPOs is because there's a ton of risk. There's a ton of like hype leading up to it and then it gets listed and then all your investment capital um, can get completely devalued. And that's a massive, massive issue. But with ISPOs, it's beautiful because again, like I said, it kind of taps into that reward structure that Cardano has built and um, really creates a situation where you can actually kind of delegate your ADA, so your actual ADA tokens, and when you do this, you're not actually risking the investment capital. So you're not actually risking the value. What you're doing is you're actually utilizing your assets. So there's no reason not to do this in my opinion. I've made videos on this on my channel, Invest Global. Um, but here for Genius Yield, the main thing to understand is they have an opportunity for people to actually enter into their ISPO and utilize this mechanism. So we're going to hop into a lot more of that in this video. But this article will have everything we talk about in this video linked down below in the description. This really lays it out very, very well. So a very, very basic understanding. I'll read this through and then kind of translate it um, for those who are kind of the uninitiated. Like I said, I just gave a little bit of a general overview, but just for a little bit more detail, the way that they describe it is that an ISPO is a new fundraising mechanism that allows delegators of a proof of stake network. So a proof of stake network would be Cardano and the delegators would be anyone, the average Joe holding ADA, delegating it to someone who's like doing this full time, right? Somebody who's running a pool with Genius Yield offers. Um, so basically it allows them um, to divert staking rewards towards a project of their choice and get projects tokens in return. So in this case, you would actually be earning passive income in the GENS token. So the actual Genius Yield token, ticker symbol G-E-N-S. And in that way, there's a lot higher upside because it's a lot more lower mark cap, but higher risk, higher return with any mark cap projects, right? So if you're looking at higher mark cap projects, there's a little bit less of a return because it's such a behemoth, but there's a little bit lower risk, same thing. So volatility, it depends on your personal risk appetite. You always have to remember that with investing. So, um, but in this case, since you're getting it passively, you're not actually buying the GENS token, you're just using the ISP peel model, it's kind of risk-free in a certain way. So that's why, like I said, I don't really know why people wouldn't be utilizing this on Cardano. Um, it just, it's a big experiment out there in the market. Who's going to be the best uh, stake pool and Genius Yield is trying to do that. So that's why this video, we're focusing all about those things. So um, it's a unique mechanism that allows the community to support their favorite projects without investing their own assets. So that's the biggest thing is it's basically like, it's, it's kind of, if you understand the process of delegation, uh, it's, it's kind of like, you know, if you're running a business, and you're looking at, okay, you're, you're doing all these different tasks, right? It's better to focus on your strengths, right? So it's, it's, it's much better to, it's much easier to go from like out of 10, a seven to a nine than it is a one to a nine, right? So it's, it's like that giant jump. So you might as well play off strengths there. Yes, you can uh, sharpen up weaknesses, but the idea behind delegation in any business and the idea behind it here is, is that same structure of the kind of mental model that essentially you should focus on your strengths. So if you're holding ADA and you're not a full-time investor and you're like, Hey, how can I make some passive income off this? That's where ISPOs come in. You don't have have the risk of the investment um, it, as it explains here. Um, but what you do have is the actual ability to tap into this incentive structure that Cardano has built um, with ISPOs and then gain passive income in something like the GENS token. But uh, in, in this case, like I was saying with delegation model, um, basically like if you're running a business and you have all these employees that like they focus on all these different things versus you're by yourself, you're doing all these tasks, you're trying to run around, you know, you're trying to fix your office, you're trying to fix, uh, like, you're basically putting out fires on a daily basis, it's better to delegate that to someone else. And you actually make more income typically uh, off the margin there, because you know what you're paying the worker, maybe it's per hour, maybe it's on a commission basis, versus what you actually make in real profit is much, much higher. So that's why it's a win win, right? It's it's a win for the person you employ, because you're growing the economy. And it's a win for you, because now you're able to focus on your strengths. So it's, it's the same idea here with delegation. And I hope that's kind of like a basic 
quick method of thinking about it. You know, those who are advanced maybe going like, oh, this is too much. But the point of this video is really to kind of introduce ISPOs and, and really help you kind of wrap your head around delegation. So, so far in the video, if you guys have any questions, any comments, anything like that, let us know down below in the comment section. Also subscribe to the channel, hit the like button if you're enjoying it so far and hit the notification bell because it's time sensitive content. So if we're looking here beyond this, we talked a bit about, you know, how you're re rewarded in the uh, network's native reward incentive structure. Um, ISPOs are only possible um, on the Cardano blockchain because of its unique stake pool delegation structure. So it's very important to understand. And then um, as far as the, the details here with Genius Yields ISPO, um, and then to end up this video, we'll kind of touch on this interesting article. They talk about, you know, Cardano's next big thing being Genius Yield. Um, so the total actual gens rewards here that will be put out will be 10 million Genesis tokens and or sorry, Genius tokens. And then ISPO launch is on December 15th, 2021. ISPO ends on June 15th of 2021 and the duration will be six months there. So you have the opportunity to potentially get in. So whether you're watching this now um, in December, moving into January, or you're watching this, you know, as it June, and maybe it's June 1st and you're watching this, it's the same rules still apply. These All these things uh, still apply. If anything changes, just reach out to the actual Genius Yield team and they'll, they'll kind of update everything. Also follow them on socials. And we'll actually be uh, announcing any updates, you know, if, if anything changes with this. But so far, I hope you guys kind of have your mind wrapped around this a little bit. Um, we'll touch on some of these like benefits. Okay, so basically, you like I was talking about, you know, win-win for the employer and the employee, um, and you're kind of growing the overall economy. So it's really a win-win-win. That's ideally what you focus on in businesses. And it's the same thing here with the crypto market, right? Because there are a lot of potentials, potential wins, but then there also are losses, right? So with this, I really don't see the losses personally. Like if you're holding ADA, right? Like if you're holding the Cardano token and you're not participating in ISPOs, I really don't know what you're doing. If I'm just being 100% honest, like I, I don't know why you wouldn't um, because there's so much benefit with, with this and you really get it again, kind of, it's like social capital, right? So you get to vote um, what the best projects you want is and that's the whole idea behind this. So um, it's, it's a much better way to raise capital, if you will. So benefits for the participants really comes down to gaining early access to the protocol tokens before the product launch gaining um, rewards in the Genesis token without actually spending your ADA, unlike an IDO. And that's the biggest thing with an IDO, you basically have to buy the actual native uh, launchpad token, have enough to actually have a minimum allocation and then buy the, the allocation. It's, it's very, very complex. This model is so much better because there's not that kind of risk you have with the investment capital. But like they said, you know, it actually can't go on in some of these other blockchains. And um, yeah, so if, if you're excited about the future of Cardano, I mean, this is a uh, very, very beneficial in my opinion, because you're actually benefit, remove the financial incentive, but you're benefiting Cardano, right? You're actually participating, right? Instead of just holding your coins in a, in a wallet where you're not actually delegating. So um, beyond this, get extra gen, um, Genius Yields tokens um, with a limited edition Genius um, NFTs um, for the bonus reward program. You can check that out there, but I'll go back here. Um, beyond this, let's see. So we talked about that, um, Genius Yield specific, and then benefits for Genius Yield. So that's how it benefits you. Those are all the positives that we just talked about. And then this is actually how it benefits the project. If you're bullish long-term on, on Genius Yield, um, it helps them develop. So it helps them actually raise, raise funds for project development, um, fair and public distribution of the Genesis tokens. It's kind of an interesting way of decentralizing uh, the, the token allocation, right? Because this model, actually, this, this article talks about this a lot. What, what I just touched on is how, how it spreads out capital in that way. And um, they talk a lot about it, how it, it kind of is like decentralizing um, the way people invest in a project, because it's basically these people are getting passive income, you know, that 10 million um, gens tokens that is going to be rewarded out there. That's not that's not going to be like one person gets it all right. That's not going to be two people get it all. It's going to be so spread out. And that's kind of the beauty of this mechanism. That's why I talk a lot this a lot about this on my channel invest global is these launch pads out there so I have this uh, playlist called like launchpad ecosystem map series and it, it's a massive issue a massive problem that I see in the market that something like genius yield and something like Cardano are actually fixing is you know these IDOs are so like it doesn't allow the average show to actually get into this and things like this some projects that I've been uh, working with recently um, are doing really exciting things that's why um, I'm looking forward to this you know they, t they talk about genius yields mission here just to retouch on this um, in this article I, f I thought it was kind of interesting um, then we'll wrap up this. Um, but Genius Yield was designed to address the complexity of navigating yield op uh, yield opportunities in DeFi. So I said at the beginning of this video, you know, Genius Yield is a yield optimizer for the Cardano blockchain. That is very important to understand. Um, its mission is to democratize DeFi for everyone by providing the best in class automated liquidity management powered by artificial intelligence. In the spirit of financial inclusion, the platform was created to cater both sophisticated and novice decentralized finance users 
At Genius Yield, we believe that knowledge is power. This is why we created Genius, Yield, Genius Academy, a community-driven educational and mentorship platform that teaches decentralized finance concepts and supports everyone in their journey towards financial freedom. I love that. That is so awesome. Um, you know, it, it's very, very interesting to see that them they're actually going out of their way to help educate people in the space. Because some people don't do that. That's something that I always do on my channel. I do I completely free series on how to kind of like get yourself started on different blockchain networks. Cardano is very promising. Obviously, they don't have everything as developed out as some of the other blockchains out there. But long term, I really, really like what Cardano is doing. That's basically all for this video. If you guys have any questions about ISPOs and Cardano or how to, how to participate in geniuses, either you can check out um, this article right here. Or you can reach out to the team, let us know in the comment sections. But like I said, that's all for this video. If you enjoyed it, like it, subscribe to the channel, and stay up to date, hit the notification bell and click all. You can visit my channel, just search on YouTube, Invest Global. That's all for this video, Invest Global, and until next time.